When I think back 25 years ago when I got into the sport of muzzle loading, I was using 2F black powder, the real stuff. Well, shortly after that, I realized that synthetic black powder like Pyrodex RS was a lot easier to clean, a lot more reliable in inclement weather conditions. But the quantum leap in muzzle loading propellant came about when Hodgdon introduced the pellet. Now, the pellet today is offered in Pyrodex as well as 777, and also IMR also offers a pellet called the White Hat. The advantage here is you can put two pellets stacked together. So each one of these is 50 grains. And the advantage here is if you're in the field and you're loading quickly and you're nervous, you're not going to dump loose powder all over the field. Now the question is where do I start and what do I use? If you're using an inline muzzle loader today, I would recommend starting with a standard Hodgdon Pyrodex pellet. Now 777 is a good brand, it's sulfur free, it may be easier to clean, but I find in inclement weather conditions, it can gum up in the barrel a little bit and the accuracy to me is not like the original. One of the advantages of loose powder is you can measure to whatever grain amount that you want, whether it's 100 grains, 105, or 110. A pellet is preformed in either 50 grain increments or 30 grain increments. For me, the simplicity of being a muzzleloader hunter, I've already fine-tuned my gun. I'm just going to put three pellets in my gun, maximum amount of powder allowed, 150 grains, and go with that. Now, if I'm looking for the ultimate of accuracy, obviously I'll try the loose powder. But for me, if I'm shooting an inch and 100 yards, I don't need the group any tighter than that. Now, when you talk about igniting your powder, it's all about what 209 primer is the best. Virtually all muzzleloaders out there are ignited with a 209 primer if it's an inline. If it's a flintlock, obviously, you're going to use 4F black powder as a priming pan charge. But primers are not all created equal. Me, I like the standard Winchester or CCI 209 primers. These are standard shot shell primers. They're not muzzleloader primers. Now, a lot of guys, there's controversy out there. They like the muzzleloader primers. For me, I want something that is hot and consistent, so even in damp and humid conditions, I know my gun's going to ignite reliably.